and it's a Monday, so it's time for Grocery Wula. For you, it's a Monday, and for me, it's a Monday. I'm doing this the day after uh, Valentine's Day. It is the 15th of February. Um, I sold out of strawberries early today. Yay! Normally, you don't want to sell out because you don't get the full day pay, but I had things to do. I wanted to go take a tan. I haven't had a tan for a while. My face needed it bad. And so I went to a tanning salon, and then I went to the grocery store. And I didn't go to Vaughn's like I usually do or the, or the liquor store. I went to Ralph's, and I haven't shopped at Ralph's for almost a year. I think almost a year now, or maybe, yeah. And um, so I grabbed a lot of stuff that, um, that I can't usually find at Vaughn's because it's a smaller market. Um, so it is more expensive. I forget how much it is, but I think it's 130 something dollars. And I always try to keep it under 100. But I went to Ralph's and I kind of um, got a lot of stuff um, that I usually cannot get. And I found manager specials and stuff. So I grabbed more stuff. It was a long line to get to to go through the ch checkout. It was a long line. I've never experienced that. It could be because it's President's Day. I don't know. But I haven't been to like a like a big grocery store for like a year. So I got kind of spoiled with Vaughn's, you know, you know, and um and liquor stores. But I did find a lot of stuff that I've been without for a while so let me just get started i was hoping that there'll be some leftover box heart boxes of chocolate see you know i'm not really into i don't eat chocolate that much but it'll be nice to have like a one of those chocolate boxes of you know but they they were they didn't have it at all i don't know they might have put it somewhere else i might have to go somewhere else later uh i don't really need it i i got chocolate here but i was just hoping to get one of those you know, like one of those fancy box of chocolates. But let me show you what I got. I got kind of a lot. Uh, I got a lot. Oh, I went ahead. Oh, and by the way, if you can't hear me, use your speakers. My Sorry for my audio. I'm going to explain it all the time for the new people. Just get a pair of fancy speakers and plug them in so you can hear me. Um, I got, of course, kitty litter, the, the fancy stuff. So I went ahead and got that. I got the spring water, not the stupid crystal geyser. I like this water better, so I got uh, spring water. And I got six bottles. So if you get six bottles of wine or champagne, you get 30% off. So I got my normal champagne brew. And then I got, this was on sale for, I forget how much, like five something. Ringmaster, uh, Sideshow, and this is a red wine blend. Because I usually just get the red wine blend. And I haven't been really drinking that much wine. But one of my neighbors, she ran out of wine. So she knocked on my door. And I, that, so I always kind of have extra wine. Because I do have neighbors that like to borrow some, borrow some wine. Actually, I just take the wine, but it's fine. And then I got some Aussie uh, Yellowtail Big Bowl Bread. And they're like five bucks. They're not, the ones at Vaughn's, you could get this at four for $4.44. This one's $5.99, six bucks, but whatever. Still my price range. So I got I got stocked up with that. And Ni and Nigel's right behind there. Don't be knocking this over. Stay right there, Nigel. No. He's a trash digger. He likes he begs for food. Like I've never had a cat like that. All my cats, they they don't want people food. They 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 don't do. Nigel different. Nigel likes people food. Like, if you leave something out, he'll he'll take it. Uh, so where do I start? Oh, I guess I can start here so this doesn't get squished. Oh. My cat's ran out of cat grass. I have it, I have some planted outside in a planter. And it just, it dries out after a while. Like, if it's uh, too much um, water or too little water or the weather. It, so I need to pull, pull it out. It's like weeds. And then plant this in. So I got some cat grass for them. And that's always kind of expensive. That's like six bucks right there. But it's for my baby. Let me get some. Mm. 
Okay. And I got some more toilet paper from my roommate's bathroom because he hasn't been really home that much. No, Nigel, stop it. Get no, 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 no. Get down, get down. He thinks it's, he's he knows it's food. Anyway, he hasn't been home, so he hasn't been stocking up lately. But like my friend Craig came over um, yesterday. We watched some movies and stuff. So you know, I still have guests. That's the guest bathroom, so I like to have toilet paper there. So I just wanted a small thing of toilet paper, so I got some toilet paper. <sighs> and I like it when I get this lettuce instead of the, the bag lettuce. This lasts longer. Like, the one I bought, like, a long time ago is still good, but I've been going through it a lot because I, I love lettuce. I, I could eat it like snacks, like chips. I love it. And so I get the romaine hearts, and I, I basically uh, chop it up and put it in containers. And it lasts a long time. So I got Romaine Hearts. And here's the manager specials. I love it. A dollar ninety nine. It used to be ninety nine cents, but it's usually like I don't know. I don't know how much this usually costs. Like six bucks, seven dollars. I don't know. But this big thing of stir fry, which will be good in ramen. If I have like if I get some chopped ramen, I could, I could put that in there. It'd be so good. Or you can make it how you're supposed to. You're supposed to stir fry it. And it comes with a sauce mix and stuff. That's all good too. But also, I put in a container. Miss Josephine. Uh, Miss Josephine. That was my other bird. May she rest in peace. My birds, my my parakeets, Sunny and Cher could eat this. So I always love to find this on sale because I eat it. The birds eat it. We all eat it. I put it in burritos. I just love this stuff. It's just a bunch of um, just vegetables. I love it. And you get a dressing to go with it. It's awesome. Alright. Oh, while I was waiting in line, the line was so long that it, I was in the frozen food section in line. This was like a dollar. It's like these things are so cheap. And it's just cheese manicotti. So when I feel something, you know, fancy. I have a few of these. I have some uh, mac and cheese and I have the big Z. And it's like is perfect when I when I don't when I don't feel like cooking or making something, you know. If I'm just hungry and I want to zap it, or if I have people over and they're hungry and they go, "Hey, you got something to eat?" And I know they're not going to want any concoction that I make because I make weird stuff. But this is like normal, even though I'm a vegetarian. There's no meat. That's that's normal stuff. Like don't eat that, right? So it's nice to have on hand for that. And then I, sometimes I feel like having some cheese and crackers, so I got some Gouda. I don't know how much it was, but I got some Gouda because Gouda's good. And manager special. I didn't know what this was. It was only $1.99. And it's dip. You know I love my dressings and dip. I eat just for the condiments. I love condiments. And I can't see what it is, but it's. I think it's like jalapeno ranch. I think it's like jalapeno ranch. I hate when they do that where it's like, okay, Dollar ninety nine, great, but what is it? What is it? But I see the jalapeno and I see it's ranch. I think it's a jalapeno ranch dressing. So I, so I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator. Jalapeno ranch dressing, yummy, yummy. And then I, I don't have any um, cold cuts, vegetarian cold cuts. This is, I think, this is the pastrami one. I like the pastrami, fake pastrami. So when I feel like having sandwiches, this is really good. Or make it into a wrap. I get a tortilla, and I got cheese, and I just um, I roll it up with a bunch of lettuce, and I make a big old wrap. It's so good. So good. I got so much food. <gasps> like, I'm not going to probably go to Rouse for a, a while. Like, it's been a year. So I stopped up. So my next grocery hauls are probably going to be, like, minimal <laughs> because I really went crazy. I went crazy. Um, I got more tomatoes. I love tomatoes and everything. I love making uh, garlic bread, like garlic toast, and I chop up tomatoes and I put the put it in the toaster oven, and it's kind of like you know it's kind of like pizza bread in a way, kind of like pizza bread. So I love tomatoes. I got tomatoes, and I got more coffee. I'm kind of getting into the oh god, are you stuck? Are the bags stuck on you? Let me get you. Let me get you. Let me get you. There you go. Nigel was freaking out. His body was stuck on that. 
So, I, you know, I usually get Maxwell House, but, you know, it's been kind of upsetting my stomach, so I've been, I wanted to get the Hawaiian, the Kona blend, but whatever, this is Don Cisco's, this is Butterscotch Toffee, that sounded good, so I got more coffee. So this here. Because I thought this was the wine, I bought this last time, but it's 10% uh, uh, Hawaiian. It's only 10% Hawaiian. I'm like, what? easier on my stomach so I've been doing that and guess what Lysol is back actually I found some Lysol at the liquor store for a really good price $7.99 the same price you I would get it before the pandemic at, at, at Vons and Ralph's now at Ralph's they didn't have regular Lysol but this is fine this is Nutrier 2-in-1 it disinfects viruses and bacteria it kills 99 so it's so I got so I don't even know how much this was Probably expensive, drift water scent, whatever. But you know me, I love my Lysol. I, I do my yoga every morning, so I want on the floor. So I like to Lysol this floor. I like to Lysol everything because um, you know my roommate comes in. I don't know where he's been. You know, it's a pandemic's going on, so I Lysol everything, and I love the smell of it. It freshens up the place. It's better than Febreze. I'm sorry, Febreze. Mm. It's the same price. I'd rather kill some germs and smells good. And I like to smell this smell better. So I got more Lysol. I got two, two of them. And I try to do the powder creamer. Because I think, you know, I don't want to, this, these creamers take so much room in the refrigerator. So I, I remember doing powder creamers because it thickens up the coffee. I like it. But you got to use so much of the powder creamer. Like, it's just not the same. So I'm like, okay, I need like regular creamer. And then course now they have different flavors because Ralph's has it's so big that there's so much stuff it's like there's, there's so much stuff it's different than what the hell Felix what are you doing he doesn't usually do this but he says Nigel do it and he goes well Nigel does it I'm gonna do it no, I'll give you the grass give me a chance okay give me a chance I was fine I, I know I need to give you more cat grass give mom a chance mama's talking to people okay Give mom a chance. My little king. Anyway, I got fruity pebbles. That sounds so interesting. I can't wait to try it tomorrow. Fruity pebbles. I can't wait to try that tomorrow. I'm going to try this tomorrow. I can't wait. That sounds so good. Uh, and then I got another one. This is like the, the Kroger blend, so this is cheaper. This is Danish style butter cookie i'm like mm, that's different i haven't seen that so i'm like okay it's probably left over from the holidays but i don't care that sounds good so i I'm, i got it and I, of course i got more salsa because people come over i do i do chips and salsa and i love the hernandez it's more like it's more watery so it's more like your restaurant um type of salsa it's refreshing so i like that uh, and then I was thinking, you know what, I better get more ketchup. I don't know if I have need ketchup. I probably don't, but I just got a backup on ketchup. I think I might have needed it. I don't know if I do. And when Larry comes over, he, 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 he has throat cancer, so he can't really do hot sauce. But he noticed he could do taco sauce. And he does the medium, so I'm wondering if he could handle the hot. I haven't seen him lately because he's been skiing. But, um... So, and plus, sometimes I feel like having taco sauce instead of hot sauce. It has a different flavor. I don't know what it is, but I thought, you know what? I'm going to get some hot sauce. So I got some hot sauce. So, yay. I got so many hot sauces and, and salsas. and I, I have so many different flavors. Like I say, I love condiments. I love condiments. I eat just stuff for the condiments. No lie, I almost got Miracle Whip, but I know I have extra Miracle Whip because it came this course. <sighs> okay. As you know, I love corn. Like, and I've been making, in fact, I didn't get mashed potatoes, but I think I have some. I've been making, um, you know those KFC bowls? You go to a Kentucky Fried Chicken, they have these bowls, and it's mashed potatoes, corn, and the fried chicken and gravy. Well, you know, I'm vegetarian, so I don't do that. But I have chicken nuggets like the vegan chicken nuggets and what I do is I put them in the oven and I almost like 
not burn them, but I, I just toast them very well done, very crispy. And then I get uh, some mashed potatoes and I get corn. And, and for gravy, I do have vegan gravy or I could use cream of mushroom soup with a little bit of soy sauce. Basically, that's kind of like gravy. And I make my own KFC bowls, but I ran out of corn. And I love corn because I could even add that to salads. I just love corn. So, I got a four pack of corn. Just your normal, regular yellow corn. I love corn. So, I got corn. This was on sale. This was five bucks. I don't care. Sometimes, you know, you don't want crackers. You don't want something salty. You just want the pita. It's kind of like more, like, it's more bland. So I got some pita chips. And I needed more crackers. Well, I didn't really need them, but I'm running low because I haven't bought them in a long time. So I got the multi-grain crackers. And I love, so when I'm hungry, I don't know what I want. I just get butter and corn tortillas. So I got more corn tortillas. I went crazy. I went crazy. And then I just got these because they were really cheap. They're garbanzo beans. And that'll be good in a salad or I guess it eat it by, my, by itself. Or you can make stuff with this. It's chickpeas. They're very good for you. And canned goods, they last a long time, so I don't mind. And this is good to take to work because there's no refrigerator. But I leave it, I leave it at the farm because it's so cold out there. You don't need to refrigerate it. So this is really good to have on hand. I got more ranch dip. And this was like on sale for 49 cents because it's dented. And this is good when I make my my um, my five layer bean dip or if I just want a burrito and stuff like that. This is spicy jalapeno, refried beans, that's good. And then I got some regular spicy refried beans. And then last time I just want some jalapenos to spice things up. So I got some jalapenos. And I've been missing these. I use these for poopoo bags. They're 97 cents for a roll. The ones at Vaughn's are like a, a dollar, no, two dollars and sixty. It's like almost three bucks. So I got a few of these because these are cheaper. I didn't get a bag, but I got more red onion. Because I got red onion in the refrigerator, but I haven't been using it. So I don't know when it's going to get slimy. So I got another red onion. Put it right there. And then I always have to have potato chips on hand when people come over or when I'm feeling snacky. I haven't tried these. They're interesting. It's called Scorching Pringles. And this is cheddar and barbecue. But I guess there's it's spicy. So I'm like, okay, I'll try those. That'll be good to come. Canisters are good for work so it doesn't get squished. So that's good to take to work. And here's my, here's my cup. So wow. And then, of course, waiting in line, you get end up buying more. Yeah, $132. Yikes. But oh well. Another thing, while I was waiting in line, because I was in the frozen food section, and I got frozen pizzas in the freezer. But this was on sale for $3.99. This big pizza was on sale for $3.99. Four bucks. And it's five cheese and marmalade thin crust pizza. I'm like, that looks good. The price is really good. And that's another thing. Like when people are over and people are, are, are hungry and they, they don't want to eat my little bird food. Chop that up. And then since Craig ate all my chips last night while we're watching uh, stuff, movies on Valentine's Day, my friend Craig, um, I had to get more regular tortilla chips. This is like, this is a stock item. You always have to have tortilla chips. And that's it. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's a lot. I bought, I bought, I, that's a lot. 130, like I said, I'm stocked up for a while, you know, for like a long time. So, I don't know what I'm going to do next week. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to buy. I'm, tr I'm trying to think. I have no idea. Like, I'm sure I'm going to get something. Who knows? You'll see. What, you'll see it. You'll see it next week. You'll know. All right. Well, I'm going to put everything away. Yeah. It's like it's like 4.40 right now. 
and I gotta get things, I gotta do a lot of things. Okay, to all my safe cadets and all my cats, I hope you have a great day. Until next time.